praise the Lord. No. I'm sorry. Okay. You guys, I'm a little bit upset. Remember how I keep saying remember because I'm thinking you know, but I always say that I hate the top of my hair. And that is so true. You see this thing right here? Like, no, this right here. It has jacked up my whole hairstyle. The whole thing. Like, my hair right now, you can't really see the definition in it. But it's a, it's a twist out. And it's so defined because I put shea butter in it. Shea butter and water is all I use. That's all I used. And um, it's really, really jacked up. That you can't really... Like, you can see the curls. But... Like, I'm mad because the rest of my hair is not going to turn out the same. <laughs> like, this part right here. It's not going to turn out the same. This puff right here, I wet it, but it's not going to turn out the same. So now I want to just wash my whole head and um, do a wash and go. <laughs> but I got to figure out a good wash and go to do because I don't know the texture of my hair. I keep coming up with assumptions, but like with 4A, 4B hair, all they have to do is like wet it. And it just, it just spikes up like, pew! My hair, if I wet it, it'll get frizzy. And doesn't have any definition to it whatsoever. And they just, they just, they wet it. And then they put some type of conditioner in it. And it, pew, just sticks out. Like, especially the short ones, the longer ones. You know, the long, longer hair ones, like African Export. I know she has a bit of a time with hers. But the shorter it is, the better. That's why I, I don't, me personally... For short hair, I like wash and goes. Wash and goes only. As far as these twist outs go, as far as these twist outs go, I'd rather for my hair to be longer. You know? So from now on, I believe that I will just be doing uh, wash and goes. Um, as far as like wetting my hair and putting conditioner in it and wearing a headband. But getting back to why I made this video, this video is about reinventing myself. I made the first one, but it was too long, and I really didn't feel like editing it for like 44 minutes, taking 44 minutes off of it. Or was it 14? I think it was 14. It was 44. Um, and uh, I'm reinventing myself, people, okay? <laughs> I want to get out of these four walls. I am a couch potato. I am lazy. I am a procrastinator. I have a person who clings to me, which is my mother, and I cling to her. So we are the clingiest people to each other. We are the clingiest people to each other, right? So this year, I'm 23. I'm, I'll be 24 in three months. And um, what I'm going to be doing is basically getting out of getting out of my room. Um, now that my court is over and I'm about to do my community service and that's about to be over in two days two days that's, that's so that's a blessing right there I, I didn't end up with like 40 hours I ended up with 10 hours that's two days worth of work and then I get to go back to work and do what I love to do and when I go back to work I told myself that I was going to get out and try to adventure more I've never been outside of my that's a lie I've been out of my state I've been to Alabama and I've been, you know, to Florida, but I've never been somewhere on my own. I've never been, like, independent. I've never had that independent thing. I've always wanted to be independent, but I'm not independent as, you know, I want to be. So, uh, this year, going forth, I will be getting out and doing things that I want to do or, you know, what, you know, the Lord has me to do, which is basically in turn what I want to do. So, when I say that, that entails what my hair I want to color my hair to a blonde color before you know I cut my hair my hair was a blonde color I'm, I'm gonna show you a picture and I'm really hoping that you can see from uh, from the picture how long my hair was and what color it was from the light so I'm probably gonna be putting the picture up somewhere in here somewhere somewhere while I'm talking Um, 
I want to dress more woman-like, lady-like, woman-like, ugh. I said feminine, wait, was it feminine? No, I said, um, feminine, that's what I said earlier, I said feminine earlier. But I want to dress more ladylike. I dress tomboyish to like, it's a cute tomboyish, like a femme tomboyish. But I want to dress more ladylike because it's what women should do. From my own, in my own opinion, it's what we were created for. We are women, so we should dress as such. We shouldn't dress like men. We should dress like women. Um, as far as my clothes go, things of that nature, I want to dress, you know, as I was created, like a woman. Um, from the head down, like my hair is woman-like, it's not shaved off, it's not like, okay, bald head or nothing like that. Not saying that there's anything, there's anything wrong with that, that's, if that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do. But for me, in my head, my house, um, I choose to be more um, ladylike. And that'll entail what, having earrings and uh, lip gloss. I may be a lip gloss, per ugh, lip gloss person, may maybe not, I don't know. These are things that I'm testing out to see what what fits me. What fits, you know, this right here. All of this right here. So, um, also, I'll be going back to school. Just, I'm doing everything now that I didn't do. What? When, when did I start school? When I was 16, 17. Like, after I, after I got out of high school, when I was 18 years old, and I, I stopped, and I was procrastinating, and I was clinging, and I was being a lazy butter cost potato. Everything that I didn't do then. I'm getting ready to get out and do now because you, we all know that life is too short and um, people are leaving, you know, people are dropping, you know, not saying that that will happen tomorrow, it could happen tomorrow, but if God, you know, wants it to happen, but I just want to do, um, majority of what I want to do before, you know, the Lord cracks the sky, which is what the Bible says, and um, hope that when it's all said and done, I'll be proud of what accomplishments that I made in life. And know that I made them on my own and made my own decisions without any say-so. Because I really don't like people inputting and, you know, putting their two cents into my mix, into my life. So, um, that is what I'll be doing. I'll be venturing out and coming into my own. Meaning, living by myself, which I don't do right now. Because, like I said, I'm clinging to a clinger and the clinger is clinging to me. So... Um, let me see. I'm just going to be putting forth the effort to do more in life, to just be me. Um, I don't really, as far as my dressing goes, I'm going to be like wearing leggings and skirts and stuff. I'm cute in a skirt. I'm, and just, just from, you know, I don't wear makeup, like foundation and all of that stuff. I'm going to be getting my contacts back and wearing extra, like these glasses. I'm going to be getting extra pairs of glasses. Instead of just having one pair of glasses and different, I'm going to have different colors of glasses. I'm just going to be, you know, doing what I want to do. Doing what makes me happy. I haven't thought about what made me happy in a long time. And so in reinventing myself, um, I find that it'll, it'll be a better me. And it, it, it'll help me succeed in life to where I can get what I need to get out of life and from life. And get all the knowledge and the wisdom and the nourishment. Life is like a big old bot. No, I can't say that. It's just something that, I don't know, I think I said what I needed to say, I just keep reiterating. I just feel like, I'm just tired of being lazy. You ever just get to the point where you're tired of being lazy? I've been tired of being lazy for like so long and I'm so, 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 so tired of sitting in this room. And I just want to get out. But when you don't have the means of the financial um, funds or, you know, the transportation to do so, um, you kind of lack in that department, but there are things you can do to uh, help you on your way, like save money, <laughs> go take tests, um, what else, buy a car, uh, be a friend to somebody who can let you buy, loan them, loan them your car, I mean their car, loan you their car, something like that, you know, be more responsible so that people will you know give you more responsibility and, and and things of that nature and I sound so much like a mentor or a tutor or something Ugh. um what else that's about it I'm gonna be taking pictures of my hair this mess on my head it looks cute in the mirror and I want to take a picture of it which I will in a second and this side of my hair is longer than this side because this side shrunk up 
last night. I slept on it. And I tried to finish this part this morning. And then I was watching a video. And I was just like, man, I'm tired of just trying to do all these protective styles. Well, not tired. Let me take that back. I'm not tired. It's just that while my hair is short, there's really not much I can do with it. And so there's two styles that I really like. That That's the, the wash and go minus the gel. I'm going to try to stay away from the gel for a minute. And then, um, yeah, minus the gel. You just put conditioner. It's a video I saw where she just um, used a deep conditioner. And she just did something else. She put some type of gel on it. But she didn't put it throughout her whole hair. She just put it like this. Like it went like this. And it just, you know, stayed. So that's what I want to do. And, yeah, that's the wash and go. And it's the puff. And then once my hair gets bigger, like it's, it's already getting bigger if you can't tell from my first couple of videos. You know, when I first cut my hair, I showed you guys my little mini twist. They were like so tiny. Oh my goodness, they were so tiny. And what else? That's about it. So I'm going to put this picture up here showing my hair in its what longer state and then I'm probably gonna put the picture of my hair in a shorter state when I did my mini twist and my my mini chop with my blue shirt and then uh, I'm gonna show you what it looks like now so stay tuned for that and comment rate subscribe and I hope that this was very um, very helpful to those of you who want to be go-getters if there's something you want go get it because right now it's the time to do it it's the time to just do what you want to do okay so if it's a man go get him you know go get him girl <laughs> if it's the money if it's a job if it's a degree you have you know all the time you don't have all the time in the world but you have time still before you get old and, 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 and your mind is gone and all that stuff so let me stop you know I just hope that this was very beneficial to you guys and I hope it's encouraging and comment rate subscribe if you can't do one or the other. If you can't do either of those thumbs wait, if you can't comment rate subscribe if you can't do one do the other, if you can't do that one do the one after that. And if you can't do either of those thumbs up, thumbs down, or just leave a comment. God bless you. I love you guys. I'm constantly praying for you. And um see you later.